So that oh. makes that, that Harley Davidson ride not sound that bad. I mean, you know, <laughs> I got we were crazy. I'm, no, I'm, I'm fine. Those were fun times. Did we wind hey. up in New Orleans after that? Well, 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 one of the very best times I ever had was yeah. living oh, yeah. the 34 oh, yeah. birds. Yeah. 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 Started out as birds, turned to Macintosh. Oh, yeah, that's a bad time. Came in there September 27th. 1978. I became your duplex mate there. Yeah. At Hurlbert Field. We were a stone's throw from the marina. Yeah. And, and you had the Jubilee. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Great what fun we had. And underneath Brooks Bridge Kitchen, as many fish as we had bait for. Yeah. We'd get four dozen. Shrimp up to them. Yeah. We'd go out there with the flat bottom John so was climb Orleans up on those catwalks, throw out, let it yeah. sit down, and bam, we're on. Oh, I know. Big, big yeah. trout. Yeah, and one after another. Hey, if we, yeah, if we, we got four dozen yeah. shrimp, we'd end up with three dozen fish. Mm -hmm. And I'm not exaggerating, am I? No, you're not. You were pregnant. And we'd have a landing net taped to the end of a long dip net so we could reach down, like 12 foot long, so we could reach down and dip them up. With tape around it? Yes. I don't even think we used duct tape. I think we used masking tape. Oh, that's probably true. We were that primitive at that time. But do you remember the story you want to capture? Is that that red fishing trip when oh. you and I were sitting there no, watching the burn and Shirley. Yeah. Oh, I thought he was about and we looked at each other and said, what the hell are we doing? Turned that thing off and we started talking about this story these old men told us way back when we first got there yeah. mm -hmm. about redfish yeah. in the cuts during October. And we said, said let's go try it. <laughs> we went on down there. You, 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 you caught an eight, eight pounder about 8.30 or so. Yeah, oh, on the Mitchell 300, I think. Played him hard, got him in. It was right in the big water. Yeah. And we were about ready to go home because we had to work the next day. It was a work day. Yeah. And we went over to the rodeo docks there at Destin. And we saw some alwives swirling in. And we said, well, let's go. He had a big 11-foot uh, cast net. We threw that thing, got ourselves three hour water, I think, went out there and caught two big old redfish, 30 to 50 pound redfish. And we said, we need bait. And this guy was on the, on the dock watching us and he said, okay, I'll go get some. And he ran over and caught us a whole bunch of bait. Do you remember that? Yep. Came, brought it back over and we proceeded for two hours catching fish like crazy, 500 pounds. Yeah, and we gave him a ride back over because he caught the bait, didn't we? 500 pounds of red yeah, fish, yeah. yeah. And we laid, we got pictures of this too, laying it out on your front lawn. Yeah. I'm gonna eat all that's here. That was an insane stringer of fish, that really unbelievable. Was. And we did it a few times more. Too. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah we did. I'll bet you, not believable. we could do it this coming out. 500 pounds of red fish. What? What? <laughs> he's Alice and I are saying bullshit. <laughs> no way. Hey, we've got the pictures. And it was we only 15 fish. That was the kicker. Uh, no. Yeah, that's right. No. 500 pounds no. with 15 no. fish. No. no. 35 to 50. What is going on? Oh, my gosh. Did you get a bull? 17s? 17. That's her second trip of the night. Great, Scott. That makes 500 pounds of red fish any day. <laughs> <laughs> she got us more believable than that. We were here for that. Man. <laughs> oh, well, <laughs> my wife will back us up on that. I'll tell you that right now. Well, ask her, Mike. Ask her. Oh, yeah. Oh, there she is over there. Three seventeens, two sixteens. Yeah, but we're just going down the beach. Uh, yeah, I know. 
Carla. But it's good. It's good darts, girl. Did Aaron and I catch 500 pounds of redfish in one night? No! More than no. once they did. No. More than no. once, yes. No! They what? caught so many redfish, but they probably had to careful. use a hatchet to cut their heads off. Yeah, that's right. Man, no. we, we lost no. several good yeah. poles to these guys. They used to steal it, they pull the whole surf in, in a matter no. of seconds, they'd have Alice a gun. Alice and I are still saying no. <laughs> I don't know. I think I was there one of those times. Yeah. You, I think I was there, and we had to use that. That, um, oh, you were there for a great trout fishing night. That was trout fishing. That was trout, 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 not redfish. Well, that was a good a red. Uh, that was as good a trout fishing night as these were red fishing the nights. Somebody had to get the net. Was that in the refueling dock? <laughs> yeah. That no, that was all. under the Brooks that's Bridge. That's the only fish. Under the Brooks I'm, I'm Bridge. And Mike sold them all the next day to that you place. You did that with us, didn't you? The restaurant we see that all the time. Yep. Uh, the seagull. I don't know, but Mike, Mike knew him well. It's my lips starting to swell up. Oh, <laughs> uh, no, ma'am. Why, why, why would it? It feels like it's starting to swell up, and I'm trying to find out what does that because I really like it starting to swell up. Oh, you do? It's better than lipos, I like it because it makes me look down. Down. Oh. 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 Big lips are big time. Kind of a Julia Roberts thing? It gives me a sexier look. <laughs> <laughs> Tequila does that with me. Excuse me. But uh, tequila does that too. <laughs> Especially expensive tea. <laughs> <laughs> I like